Hello auto lovers, welcome back to Auto Universe channel, we hope you guys in good health. Today we gonna show you 2023 Kia Sportage walk around and review, and explain the details of the car, we hope you guys enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos, thanks for watching. 2023 Kia Sportage starting at $27,615. The 2023 Kia Sportage separates itself from the throng of compact crossovers with its extroverted styling. The Kia's unconventional face features a set of alien-looking headlights and a distinct grille design. Its bolder bodywork is also dimensionally bigger than before, which translates to more cargo space and a roomier interior. Inside, the new Sportage is both attractive and packed with tech that includes a massive dash-mounted screen. Motivation comes from a 187 horsepower four cylinder, but a hybrid and a plug in hybrid are also offered, reviewed separately. Competition is tough from segment stalwarts such as the Mazda CX5 and the Honda CRV, but the 2023 Sportage proves it has more to offer than just a wild looking exterior. What's new for 2023? The Sportage enters a new generation for the 2023 model year and shares its platform, technology, and powertrains with the Hyundai Tucson, which was redesigned for 2022. The mid-range EX appears to offer the most value here, adding desirable features such as the larger 12.3-inch infotainment screen, wireless smartphone charging, and heated front seats. Engine, Transmission, and Performance the Sportage's default powertrain is a 187 horsepower 2.5 liter four cylinder that mates to an 8 speed automatic transmission and either front or all wheel drive. We sampled both the base four cylinder and the hybrid powertrain during our initial test drive and were more satisfied with the latter than the former. At our test track, the non hybrid Sportage needed 8.6 seconds to hit 60 miles per hour versus only 7.4 seconds for the hybrid. The Sportage rides on a new platform with a longer wheelbase than the previous generation and ride comfort is improved as a result. The introduction of rugged-looking trims such as the X-Line gives the compact Uda an off-road vibe, but the X-Pro actually has some equipment to help tackle the rough stuff. It rides on black 17-inch rims and all-terrain tires, and features a selection of drive modes. Interior, Comfort, and Cargo Inside, the Sportage makes an impression with a snazzy design highlighted by a huge digital display on the dashboard and other various eye-catching details. The interior is available in an attractive two-tone color scheme as an option, but if you prefer an all-black cabin that's available too. The center console boasts a rotary shift knob, a push-to-start button, and a myriad of other controls that blend into the piano black bezel. Thanks to bigger dimensions overall as well as a longer wheelbase, the Sportage has more rear seat legroom and 40 cubic feet of cargo space behind the back seat. There's also a dual-level cargo floor for even more versatility. Fuel Economy and Real World MPG The Sportage is rated for 25 miles per gallon city and 32 miles per gallon highway when equipped with front-wheel drive, all-wheel drive models are rated for 23 miles per gallon city and 28 miles per gallon highway by the EPA. We haven't yet taken the Sportage on our 75 miles per hour fuel economy route, but when we do we'll update this story with test results. Infotainment and Connectivity On the infotainment front, the Sportage comes standard with desirable features such as Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. An 8.0-inch infotainment display is standard and all models come with a digital gauge display, too. We'd suggest upgrading to the larger infotainment display, though, which measures 12.3 inches in diameter and provides more connectivity and crisper graphics. There are also neat touch-sensitive controls below the infotainment interface that alternate between the climate system and the stereo. An upgraded Harman slash Carden unit is available as well as a wireless phone charger and a subscription-based Wi-Fi hotspot.